Hello, what's up? As you all know, um, I'm having issues with my cooling system. Um, I got Thomas coming over tomorrow and he's gonna be like helping me out. He said we're gonna get this fixed tomorrow, so looking forward to that. But I mean, I really can't sit around and wait. So today I'm gonna try a little test. So what we got here is my old thermostat that I removed. And this has a, you could probably see, yeah, see that number 170? That is the rating for when this thermostat will open. So I've already installed a new thermostat and um, I don't know, I, I assume it's working, it's brand new, but there is a likelihood that it could be faulty. Well, anyways, I really wanna check that this isn't working correctly. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use a pot that we don't really use. Yeah, it's a nice looking pot, but we don't use it. I'm gonna put water in here, right? Enough to um, cover the uh, thermostat. And then I'm gonna heat it up on the oven until it hits 170 degrees, maybe a little bit over. And um, pretty much when it hits 170, it should, uh, I guess, contract. We'll see. Let's do this thing. Okay, so we're at about 70 degrees. Let's see if this thing changes. All right, so the idea behind this test is if my thermostat is working, right? That means it's working. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how, how else to put that. So if that's working, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in the lewd and try to run it again because maybe that new thermostat I put in doesn't work because um, I've replaced that thermostat before I even changed all the sensors and whatnot. So since all the sensors are good, the electrical stuff is good, it's gotta be a thermostat because um, I'll let the car run, right? And um, that return hose is still like pretty cold. So maybe coolant isn't going through the thermostat. We'll see. With this test, it's gonna verify that my old thermostat was good. And if this is good, we'll go ahead and put it back in the loot tonight and uh, warm up the car and see how that goes. Yeah. We are just 10 degrees away. I think I see it moving. No, I don't. All right, so it's at 180 degrees. Um, Maybe it's the top part we should be looking at. I think it looks open. No, not really. I can't tell. I really can't tell. All right, so there we have it. I don't know if it opens up any further than that. We are at about 200 degrees and yep that thing works so maybe i should just pull out the other one and see if that works because um i mean i could just pull it out and return it yeah no because obviously this one works well yeah that's how a open thermostat looks like giggity yo let's watch this thing close all right so right now it's open Oh jeez! <laughs> yeah, I can't believe chopsticks. All right, open, and let's watch it close. Mm, close. Now. Now? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, science, baby. Cool. All right, so, oh, man, I hate doing this, but let's go ahead and drain some coolant. I've gone through about three bottles of coolant, yo. Um, I'm gonna try to catch as much as I can and waste as little as possible so I can reuse the coolant. Yeah, so right now we're about to go and pull the thermostat. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and test it in here too just to see if the new one works. Because if it does work, then that means it's not the issue. Because I do know that the one I already had was working. Because we just tested it. Yeah! Uh, Oh man, I really don't want to waste coolant. <laughs> huh, that wasn't so bad. Ah, ah, shit. Oh. I just fell. Don't worry about me. I'm good. Oh, this doesn't really fit either. Oh, it's going the wrong way. Oh, come on. Okay. A little bit better. Now, time to waste some more coolant. Oh, let me just. Oh, all that waste. No. Dang. 
Man, that sounded like so much coolant. I don't even want to look under the car, but let's take a look. Huh. Doesn't look too bad. Whoa, it caught most of it. Oh yeah. But look at all that waste though. Man. All right, so this is the thermostat housing. And here's the inside of where the thermostat sits. Yeah. Okay, so we're back inside and we're gonna test the new thermostat that I bought. Whoa, check it out. It works. You see it? Yeah. And pull it out. Damn. So it is open. Now watch it magically close. Or not, boring. All right, so now we know that both thermostats work. That's really weird. So, what's the deal? You know, that new fan switch was pretty expensive and it should work. This is weird. I don't know, I guess uh, we'll see what Tom explains tomorrow. Well, all right guys, that was a little cool experiment that I wanted to try myself. Uh, so now, if you didn't know, that is how a thermostat opens and closes, just by temperature. Nothing electrical is needed for this to be activated. Yeah, all right, well, uh, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, like, and give a comment down below. Oh yeah, and don't forget, subscribe if you haven't. All right guys, see you on the next one. Yeah!